Detectives aren't supposed to get bloody knuckles. But I've done a lot of things I wasn't supposed to do. I lived through it all. Beatdowns, the backstabbing, disrespect most people wouldn't see in 10 lifetimes. And I never lost a fight. Until now. Uh, hi, uh, I'm Yosuke Shiokawa from Square Enix Japan. I'm a creative director of Murder Soul Suspect. Murder Soul Suspect is about solving your own murder case as a ghost detective. So, game genre is an uh, action adventure game. So, player will control uh, ghost detective character, then uh, player does a lot of gameplay like including investigation, combat, traversal, and puzzle, and also exploration. But fi finally, but it has to solve your own mother uh, case. Yeah, it's not easy case. So uh, yeah, in our present today's presentation, you can see a little bit killers or information about killer, but mystery becomes more bigger and complex, and we have a lot of twists. Yeah. Hey man, what are you doing? Hey, move away from the body now. So tell us a bit about uh, the character of uh, Ronan, your de detective. What kind of a man is he? Uh huh. Yeah, he's not a uh, good, good detective, good cop. So his parents, yeah, his parents are thief, and he was in the bad side, uh, in childhood. But he met uh, his wife. Then he tried to change his mind. He be he tried to become good guy. Then. He, he finally he becomes a detective, but he got killed. <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. Hey, did you hear me? How does the detective aspect of the game actually work? How how do you follow clues and how do you actually solve cases? Oh yeah, so Lona, our main character, is uh, was great detective, but now he's ghost. He can't do usual detective things uh, like picking up clue or uh, interrogate, leaving uh, witness. But now he is he is a ghost. He has a ghost ability, like possess possessing, and uh, he can hear Ibasrop. Uh, he can does Ibasrop or mind lead, or, or and also he can lead a past event as a from memory residues. So he has a this kind of ghost ability. Then he can solve his your own murder case. So it seemed to be there was a, a mechanic where it's about kind of lining up your own thoughts in your mind mm -hmm. so kind of you would have a bunch of different options to choose from of different things right, right, right. and it's about picking the ones that are right is that can you ex kind of explain how that system works oh yeah so in in the crime scene player interact a lot of element like gun or uh, body or witness then uh, important information becomes clue clue we call it clue but it's not a physical clue it's a more my mind mental clue then so at certain moment uh, player has to combine or analyze all of clues then he has to uh, player has to find uh, own uh, conclusion or uh, yeah de he does deduction <laughs> my god hey no 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 The other thing about being a ghost detective uh -huh. is that he can walk through uh, walls, exactly. right? Yeah, exactly. That is kind of a tough and fun uh, moment. So uh, when team proposed that idea, puzzle idea, I, I, I had a bunch of concerns like, is it work or is this fun? <laughs> but we did prototyping, then we, I played prototyping, then I feared, oh, this is great, it's just fun. So I think you'll enjoy it. Yeah. I mean, you have the concept in there that people in Salem uh, consecrate their walls right, so right, that ghosts right. can't enter. Is that yeah. a, is that a real thing that happens? Yeah, I think yeah we did uh, we did a lot of research. Then we 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 conclude with that fiction notion. Yep. Oh 
You also have um, combat mechanic in there. There are demons right, for right. you to fight. Can you sort of explain how that works? Yeah, so demons are uh, uh, kind of threatening element in the afterlife world. So afterlife is not comfortable space for a ghost. So, and uh, also we call it combat, but it's not a pure uh, run and gun action based fighting moment. So it's kind of one, one of investigation. So player has to uh, learn enemy's location, enemy's behavior, or AI pattern, then player analyze, investigate their behavior, then player does uh, find solution, then does uh, execute. So it's kind of a puzzle or investigation action part. Hey! Get back! Get back here! I said! I, I wanted to talk about a couple of the games that mm -hmm. uh, may have been influences on, on Murdered. Uh -huh. For example, um, L.A. Noir is obviously a big uh -huh. detective game. Uh -huh. Did you play L.A. Noir? Of course, yeah. I played a bunch of adventure investigation, of course, including L.A. Noir and uh, CSI, Sherlock Holmes games, and uh, Japanese games like Ghost Trick or Hotel Dust. I played a lot. Then, yeah. All, yeah, all of them influenced our game. Yeah, Ghost Trick was also was another one I was going to mention. It seems uh -huh. like that that has maybe been an influence on uh, on this game as well. Oh yeah, so yes, theme is kind of similar, but uh, we are making more mysterious, dark, unsettling feeling game. We are not making a co comic comical game. Yeah. 